Well, that video I meant to be a little bit longer than that, but thanks to my phone ringing and it being an important call because, hey, I have family! Principal ah. Wells, are you serious? I'm toast if he sees me. <laughs> ah, fuck it. I'm Miss Caulfield. You have to be stealthier than that. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You know that. I, I'm sorry, Principal Wells. I'm still tense after I thought Kate was going to jump today. I just needed some air and space to walk. No, no explanations. Seeing Kate come up on that roof, then seeing her come down with you. You saved her ass. <sighs> Maybe saved Blackwell. Now don't get cocky. Going back inside. You earned good dreams. Trying to be all principal like Sam. So how do I get past him to meet Chloe? Ooh, the flippity flip nose. <laughs> Max the ninja strikes again. Tee hee, hello well. Max, you no know ninja. Okay. On campus. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it's just because like it's texting slowly. How do we? How do I do that? Uh, there we go. Chloe, three texts from her. Warren! Mom! And private number. <sighs> well, that's all the text. Wait. Didn't walk pretty far. Hmm. Well, let's get going on and find Chloe. Booya! <laughs> Yeah, Get it? Up. Booyah. That Wait, should scare me a second scary time. Punk ghost. More like a scary punk asshole. Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. <laughs> Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing, and your badass power is gonna save us all. We just need to connect the place. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Mm. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Oh yeah, there's that thing. <laughs> uh, chaos theory. Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to, oh yeah, manipulate time and space. No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. All right, Scott. Especially I after I just got Nathan expelled. Or, uh... Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? We need to find out more about who Rachel was involved with around here. She was able to blend in with everybody, even with people I hated. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck well, the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. Rachel. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Kicking it in Los Angeles? That would be the best case scenario. She wouldn't leave without me, okay? And how often do missing girls turn up? We have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. 
I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. <laughs> Friendships everywhere! Now there's walking along. Thank you so much for helping me put together a portfolio. What? Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Oh, Listen, you've seen her entry. already. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That oh, could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think Gross. that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Anna, you weird. Are you fucking kidding me? <sighs> so stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil, I she's like about that. to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. You can always let me get busted like you did with the weed. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? We can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on, one more door and our work here is done. Yep, let's go. Wait. Nah, just go. That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. Okay. He's high shit, like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking, thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. <laughs> We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key, just in case. Yeah. Well, I yes, could. I could. Dead end. Yeah, I have a feeling these are file cabinets, so maybe I should look over at the desk. Mm, search. <sighs> no keys here. Well, no! The desk isn't completely covered with junk. So. Search? Nothing to see here. Nope. Alright. Let's just look. Search. Desolation. Hmm. Oh, hey, key stuff. Oops, wrong one. Here are the keys. 
None for the principal's office. Okay, there sincerely aren't. Only a total phony would wear a crappy hat like that. <laughs> yeah. Guess I gotta search every door. Door? Yeah, I gotta search There's every door. Here. Told you there were key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. The Warren. Am I right? Hey, Warren. You busy? Yep. Just bubble hearth. You'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kind of know how? Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. Yes, I'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in. Thanks for the help. It's a little date. T L O L. Take it. This sucks ass. Got to do it. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, exactly. Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? Hmm. I'm gonna go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Exactly. Come on, Max. Let's go look for the. There we go. Warren. Let's see. Whoa, what is that? Uh, okay, sugar, soda can, duct tape, and sodium chloride. Sugar, soda. Warren is such a classic Warren? nerd. Was it Warren? Let's see if I can find those items. Wrong buttons. Wrong person. Come on. There we go. Sugar, soda, duct tape, sodium chloride. Sugar, soda, duct tape, sodium chloride. All right, at least the soda's right here. Release the crack can. <laughs> cool pun, I guess. Very punny, if I do say so myself. It's all mine anyway. <laughs> now, wait, was that a pun? Uh, I don't Only three more items to go. Mm -hmm. And I think sodium chloride would be here. Open sesame. Open sesame seed! Gross. I hate that formal and smell. Oh, sugar. Sugar. Spice. And everything mm, nice. Sugar. These. And a little. You're chemical. halfway home, Max. I don't know if anyone recognizes that. And. Warren texted. Did you blow up, Max? Alright. If I were to chloride, I would probably be in here. You're an artist, damn it, not a scientist. But, but this is so not sodium chloride. I wonder. Here's the sodium chloride box. Mm. Where's sodium chloride? Up. So, sodium chloride is a weed killer. You'd think Warren would have told me that factoid. Nah, he didn't. So, do I need to move the chair? I can't move the chair. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. <laughs> I said that in the first place. Wonder if anyone will notice. 
notice that chair Only one more ingredient left. I think duct tape would not be in here, though. I think you'd find that in the photography area, JK. I don't know. Actually, it is. Why do I hear a car door slam? Is someone I know here? This is like a scene in a horror nope. film. I just got up from my chair and checked to see if anyone's home. Contest pictures? Ooh, let's see. Look. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Shit, Victoria. That is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? They just have polka dot eyes. Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer, <laughs> said Max, the art critic. LOL. Duck tape! Duck tape, duck tape, duck tape. Ticker tape. The tape is mine. Yes. Now I guess we gotta go back to Chloe. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. Yeah, let's go show her. Well, we could tell her, but. Hold up. Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. Smoking is bad. Don't smoke. Get cancers and Ooh, poster. Nah. It's bad stuff. Don't don't do it. Whoa, Kate's locker. So glad you still have your locker, Kate. Okay, it's okay. Wait, can I go in this classroom? Bully free. Yeah, this place is not bully free. You got bullies everywhere, and they're bad people. They're bad to the bone. <laughs> Speaking of goats, oh, what is that? Okay, poster. Speaking of goats, me and my friend were like going down the road, and all of a sudden we heard a baby goat, and he's just like, Bleh! and it was just like, holy smokes! And we thought a kid was crying, and it was a kid, that it was a baby goat kid. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! If you'll light the candle. This is so cool! Get ready to haul ass. Hmm. No! Oh! That was so fucking cool! Oh, oh no! Toast! Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, so what should we do? Why do we hear another car door? Anyways. Uh. Maybe we do this. Okay. And we still have the junk in our stuff. Unlock. Gotta get this bastard open. She can't cheat with her reading. <laughs> oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. <laughs> I think we should just do it. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers oh, only man. go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money, but no taste. Mm, I don't know. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? <laughs> I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan. 
Anybody. I'm on the case. Alrighty. And I think with this, I'm gonna let off because it's been 20 minutes. And I need to find out what that banging noise is, so. And we'll get back to Warren. So, see you guys later, and have a lovely day.